Good morning. I'm Michelle Heron with your local 3 News Fastcast. Give us one minute and we'll tell you what's happening. A man has died after last week's chemical fire at Metal Heat Treating Facility TSUSA near downtown Chattanooga. The victim was severely burned. Experts say it appears a chemical reaction caused an explosion. TSA OSHA is now investigating the circumstances that led to the death. A Pikeville woman is facing multiple drug charges. Lara Kate Peterson was stopped by police on Saturday for driving carelessly, that's according to police, through a construction zone on Apison Pike. Officers found Peterson in possession of marijuana, heroin, more than a pound of meth, and two firearms. Well, starting this week, there will be active shooter training sessions for Dalton Police. The sessions aimed at preparing and enhancing the skills of Dalton Police Force will take place over the next two months at Hammond Creek Middle School. Dalton residents should be aware that there will be a significant presence of police vehicles and personnel at the middle school on the dates on your screen. Take the news with you inside our app and check back with us throughout the day. I'm Michelle Heron. That's your Fastcast. News in one minute.